out there, Apple Biteys. This is your Apple Bite, Rafael Tavares. And welcome to the next episode of our show, The Written Writ. Of course, we and you and you and I, and whichever position or preposition or whichever which way you want to say that, we take a journey together to become better writers. Yes, we do this by using the writer's tool called the writer's prompt. Of course, we all know that the writer's prompt is a phrase, a word, a question, or something that gets us writing. Right. Get it? Right. Well, anyway. Um, so this week, what I want to speak to you guys about, 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 of course, I will try to continue my speaking and try not to mumble. It's a representation churn. As a writer, what you're supposed to be doing all the time is listening. Not eavesdropping, listening. When you're listening, you're going to be picking up bits and pieces of conversations, of things happening all around you. These become little bits of writer's prompts because if you hear something interesting, then you can use it as a writer's prompt so you can go out there and write. The inspiration for writing is all around you. I find it everywhere. Be it in a coffee shop, be it on the train, be it wherever I am, I am constantly, constantly, mm, yes, mumbling, not good, not good at all. Well, I am constantly listening to what's going on. Um, of course, like I said, try not to eavesdrop. Nobody wants to know, want, nobody wants you eavesdropping on their conversation. But what you can do is pick up bits and pieces of phrases, of things being said. It is just fantastic. What you want to do is just pick up on little bits and pieces here and there. Either that or when your friends are talking to you, actually listen to them. Yes, I know that is kind of difficult. But if you listen, you might pick up something that you can use to write. Because there's constantly something happening out there to help you become a better writer. Or for you to use as a writer's prompt. If you want to write, there is something for you to write about out there everywhere. You will have all these little bits and pieces of conversations that you can pick up and use. Again, I must say, please do not eavesdrop on other people's conversations. What you're doing is listening and you're picking things up that you can use right now i say all this because this writer's prompt behind me ah i got that one at work someone came into work the other day and they asked me or they told me or it was a statement or whichever direction you want to go with that they came and they said i just want a normal cup of coffee yes they came in and said i just want a normal cup of coffee mm. This got me to get thinking, and I understand where she's coming from because I think she just doesn't want to deal with all those fancy schmancy coffees that we have in our oh, fancy schmancy coffee shops. <laughs> but it was just such a strange request to make to come into a coffee shop, especially a fancy schmancy one, and ask for or make a statement such as, I just want a normal cup of coffee, just normal, just very normal. Mm. Of course, nothing's normal. <laughs> anyway, if you want to take this phrase and you want to make it a little more difficult, you can use our word of the week, which is eloquently, which is the way I am trying to speak at the moment. I am trying to speak eloquently so you guys can understand me and not do that mumble, mumble, mumble thing that my best friend keeps telling me I do. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, if you want to see what I'm doing, check out dranix.tumblr.com and you can see what I am writing. Now, if you want to write something, you can always put it in the comment section on the bottom. That way I can see it right away. If not, link me to your Tumblr page. Or just get it to me somehow, somewhere, and we can start doing this process where I check you out and you check me out. How you doing? Yeah, baby. <laughs> That's not what I meant. Um, anyway, ah, I want you guys to remember, 
press that little box down there that says subscribe. It's sexy. It's beautiful. It's nice. If you get us 100 subscribers, we shall do a music video for you. We will give you a list of songs to pick from, and then we shall do the video that you decide we do from that list, that is, of course. So get us 100 subscribers, and we shall do that music video. Now, that is all for our show this week, The Written Writ. You guys have fun. Enjoy yourselves. Get to writing. And listen. Yeah, be a good friend. Start listening. Really pay attention. But don't eavesdrop. All right? Do not eavesdrop. Okay. Nobody likes anybody eavesdropping. Not at all. Not at all. Mm. All right. So that is the writers, the writers, the writers, the written writ. Of course. <laughs> that is the written writ for this week. Tune in next week when we do episode whatever it is at the moment, and we move on to our next writing, writer's prompt, or whatever fancy, fancy thing pops into my head. Adios. <laughs>